Well, tens of thousands of migrants are fleeing Bangladesh's capital, Dhaka, amid a surge in coronavirus infections. The spike has prompted the government to tighten restrictions beginning Monday. The lockdown will curtail most economic activity and confine people to their homes. Now, those who move to Dhaka for work are rushing to return to their home villages before the lockdown takes effect. Thousands cram onto this ferry, hoping for a spot to get home. Being this close to others in a pandemic isn't ideal, but they face a tough choice. Stay in locked down Dakar with no work or support, or go back to their home villages to be with family. We have to accept reality. There is nothing else we can do. We are simply victims of the situation. I am heading home. What would we do during this lockdown? It's better even to starve with my family in the village. These ferries have been operating 24 hours a day, trying to clear the backlog and get people home. Authorities say they try to stop overcrowding, but people's desperation means they don't listen. The exodus from Dhaka was sparked by a surge in coronavirus infections. Case numbers have reached 6,000 a day. In response, Bangladesh's government is issuing a stay-at-home order, with shops, transportation and offices to close. Meaning many will lose their jobs, with no way to pay for food or rent, leaving these people with few options, other than to cram onto these ferries in an effort to find support in their hometowns.